comms locked. Thank you. Guys have uh, asked our crew to give it a lot of comms so we can kind of maintain control over here. So none of you can talk on this channel. Sorry. Um, I'll open it up again and have you guys share some words. But I think for us to kind of maintain some sort of control, this was necessary because we've got uh, about 70 users here. So there's a lot of stuff going on. I'll uh, go ahead and repeat what I typed. I'm really glad you're here today. Thank you again if you were here at the Rat Chat. Um, this is pretty awesome. I'm going to go ahead and have you guys, uh, I'll start with my team and uh, or the rats. We'll go through and share some thoughts. Uh, this 15 years is a huge milestone for the game. And these guys uh, that are on our team right now, all of these guys in this channel were players just like you. And this is uh, a pretty big deal for them as well to be part of the team. So I'd, I'd like to start off with them uh, sharing their thoughts. We'll start with Bodron. We'll go to Heavy, Coyote, Badger, Frisbone, and Ohm, and then T-Gunner. Then what we'll do is we'll invite you uh, to share some words with uh, the other community members here. Of course, you can continue to type in the game and all that. Uh, but on TeamSpeak for us, um, let's try and keep it to no more than 30 seconds per person. Keep it beneath that if we can. Um, we'll call for you guys to, if you want to share a few words. Uh, this is a big deal. It, it may seem kind of corny, but, you know, hey, we're an online community. This is normal stuff. Uh, so, Fodron, you're up first. Uh, what would you like to say to the community? Uh, well, 15 years, that's a long time, and uh, hope to have a, another 15 years. So, um, here's to another. Hey, with 265, uh, been here since 2002. Can't think of another game that is as awesome. And the community. I want to work hard for this community because you guys make this game what it is, besides the obvious. So thank you guys for the last 14 years, and uh, continue on for the next 15. I, I, I can't even impress upon you how incredible it is that we're a player-funded organization, independent software company, still around. It's awesome. Thank you. Uh, Coyote here, uh, 2002 December player on the Mac side. And talking to a lot of people in the game, just people that started out in high school, graduated, went to college, graduated, are out in the real world with wife and kids and their first real job, still playing this game. It's been a big part of many people's lives. Hi, folks. Badger here. It's really awesome to look at everybody that's in this chat room. We have a mixture of new players, old players, you know, players like Tech64, Rebel357, Babel. Oh, the list is long of some original players of the game. And then we see all the new green tags in the game today. I came back because I'm excited about the new team. They have a good vision for the game I believe in. And I think you all would believe in everything they're fixing to do. They discussed a lot of it with you today. I hope you join us for the ride. Brisbane here. I'm a 2002 user and uh, on the development team. <laughs> And I'm hoping to uh, fix a lot more stuff and try to implement a lot of the things that you guys are asking for, as long as it makes sense. Ohm here from 2006. Came from another game that's not even around anymore. And this game's well out surpassed it, only because of the great community we have here and the you know camaraderie we have. And uh, a lot of new ones hopefully we'll get, and we've lost a lot over the years. Uh, it, hopefully, we'll just keep continuing to grow, get bigger, and uh, enjoy this great game that we have. Too good or that's you? Me? Jeez. What can I say that's not already been said? Ditto to all of the above. Um, since year 2001, it's been a great ride, and I hope it continues, because I need something to do in my old age. You're next, Zoom. <laughs> uh, sorry, I'm the, I'm the uh, translator here. Um, I've been here since I was 14 years old. I started July 16th of 2002. My brother and I used to spend a lot of time uh, at the mall here in Oregon. That's where I'm from. And we walked into uh, EB Games 
And that's what we did all the time. It was just uh, no big deal. And I saw this game on a shelf. I never heard of it. I never did any research. I saw it. I was like, I, I was, I was big into World War II. I was the weird kid that went to school that had his World War II picture book before all of this. And like, hey, check this out. My friends are like, okay, that's cool. You want to play football or something? I'm like, no, man, this is awesome. <laughs> uh, I did end up playing football, but um, I never thought I would be doing what I'm doing today. I remember uh, when I was younger and going through uh, high school. Uh, spending my time going through the forums and being in high command and, and totally getting involved with what's going on. It's been so much fun. Um, I got on board with the team in 2010, um, and from there I've just kind of worked my way up. Obviously, we've had some folks go, and uh, it's been a real pleasure and a challenge, uh, probably one of the bigger challenges of my life. So um, I think that my team shares with me uh, the same mentality of we are super dedicated to this game. We're deeply passionate about moving it forward. Every day we show up, it's not like going to some miserable job. It's something we are really wanting to do. We're very happy with what we're doing. Yeah, we have our challenging days and challenging customers, but we love you all at the end of the day. No big deal. Um, but what is a big deal is that we've made it this far. We have literally survived impossible odds that would have killed any other company in any other game. I want you all to be incredibly proud of what we've been able to achieve. And for the new guys who are just, or the old guys who are coming back for the first time uh, since a lot of negative stuff happened, welcome back. It's a different state of uh, the, com the company, the game, and I hope you're here to stay with us and help us get not only to Steam, but to build the next version. And uh, guys, thank you for sticking with us through all of this. Um, it has been a very challenging uh, four years, and uh, I'm so glad that the challenging, you know, tough part is over with. We've got a way out. There's we're not only seeing the light at the end of the tunnel, we're going through that light as we speak. So with that said, um, if we can, I'd like to hear from other uh, community members. Let's give them a chance to, to talk and share their thoughts. Uh, if that's something you want to do, the same procedure as with the uh, rat chat, just let us know uh, via requesting voice power, and I guess Heavy will monitor that, yeah? Sure. All right, first one up, Coiler. I will grant you now, sir. Oh, oh voice. I've been playing this game. Background noise, Coiler. Battles. Background noise. Give me a sec. Show me eight. There we go, there we go. Right, I've got two daughters, one called Beth, one called Ruth. Beth plays the game. Beth has been playing this game for three years now. I've been playing this game for a lot longer than that. And through the whole time yet, through the thick and the thin, what makes me think is just this wee part, this game name. Type it in. Password, type that in, press enter, and what's going to happen? You've got no idea. And that's where you lot, is a community that keeps that going. Because you have no idea what's going to happen next. It's, to me, it's a fairy land. And within that fairy land, I've got good friends, I've got good mates, and I've got people that I can just sit and talk shit with and enjoy myself. And to me, that's more than anything. It's not an escape. It's somewhere I can go to to realise a dream of where I want to be in that moment. So, boys, keep the dream going. Thank you. You're welcome. Ooh, uh, salute. Darwin, you're up, sir. Ladies and gentlemen, howdy. Um, I've been around since February 2002. Um, it's about the only thing that I could possibly say I would play for this long is this game. Um, ups and downs, good things, bad things. But every day you log in, you get on TeamSpeak, whether you're playing Allied or you're playing Axis, and you got the same guys and ladies that you play with. And it's so much fun to hang out with these people. You know, we, um, we know people from all around the world. And I feel like these guys are my friends. I could meet them in real life. I can remember some of the mini cons we used to have. Um, 
and they were a lot of fun, and the game has continued to get better. Um, obviously, some bad times, some good times, but, you know, the problems that we all face are on both sides. It's something we all face together, and it's something I wouldn't dream of, of going somewhere else to play a different game. Um, thank you guys very much, and I look forward to another 15 years. Thank you, sir. And what you described is uh, pretty much life. All right, let's see who's next here. <laughs> BitTor, you are up, sir. Hi, guys. I'm a 2001 to 2007 veteran. Came back. Thank you for opening this up. It really is awesome uh, in comparative to the way it used to be. I do have a question, though. I wasn't. I didn't get to ask my second question. Zoom, if this is possible. Got kind of any um. ways of or thinking about? Um, Sniffing the user side code for hacks. I'll be happy to speak with you after that. For now, let's uh, stay on target with uh, what we're currently focused on, and that's the celebration of uh, 15 years. Find me after this, and we'll go through it, okay? I see you're muted, but uh, we'll go after that and address that. Uh, next one. Nick Dundee from Australia, you're up, sir. Thanks, mate. I just wanted to say um, a big thank you to everyone from the Anzacs. Um, the squad's been around for quite a while, and we're actually talking about having another COD sometime uh, later this year or maybe next year. So that's how much interest in is being regenerated in the game with all your hard work. So I appreciate that. This game's been around for ages, um, and I've met a lot of awesome blokes uh, playing it. So. Thanks for all the hard work and keep it up. Quinn Cannon, you are up, sir. Thank you. I, uh, I'm a latecomer. I joined in 2012. Um, I played a bunch of other World War II games, and then I came here, and I wrecked a bunch of equipment, and people told me it wasn't so bad. Um, and... Then I got a chance to join High Command, and I got a chance to participate in the game. And that's one of the things that I like about it is that in no other game, in no other situation, have I had a chance to be as much a part of the game and to help participate in it. Um, the Rats CRS have give more attention and more consideration to their players than I have ever seen in any other game. The community is fabulous, as so many have said, made friends all around the world that I will never forget. And uh, I also want to take a minute to remember those like Buckeyes and Keezys um, who were here before I was and who have, you know, spent their last days playing this game. And every one of them that I ever heard loved it. And... You know, I just like to mention their memory as well. Thank you very much for the kind words. Number 25, sir. You are up. Uh, it's been a pleasure. I like Zoom. I started playing this game when I was probably about like 12, 13, after seeing it at a buddy's house. And uh, you know, you have those years where you're, you're in and out. And Coyote likes to say that. Uh, yeah, I've heard him say it a few times. You know, it, the game kind of goes hand in hand with your life we have people that that leave because things happen then come back after you know they come back after they get married have kids but for the most part they always come back and uh i don't know i, I haven't found anything like it where you come back and you see so many names that you recognize and you get to catch up with people all over again very good sir X cast uh, as long as you don't have any questions, sir. If you want to talk about what, what's going on and how you've liked this game for this long, that's great. If you have questions, we'll save them for a private chat after. You're up. Late, later, then. I'll talk to you later. Okay, sir. Uh, I just logged in, and evidently, I don't know what you guys talked about, so I'll listen to the recording, and then I'll come back to you. You got it. Thank you for that. Tendal, 
You're up, sir. All right, thanks, guys. Hey, first, can you mention TeamSpeak on a system so that everybody can join in in here? Again, I don't think there's half the people don't know what's going on. With the address, please. And then I'd like to say, gosh, guys, I've been here since 2005. I uh, had no idea what was going on when I first joined. I mean, back then, the player curve was, or the learning curve was ridiculous. I think I've been trying to fly a plane since, I don't know, since 2005, and I still can't get a kill. So if I do, it's lucky. Uh, I'd like to mention a couple of guys that I know and love to hate. Matt Amore. Exo Horvath, Easy Relay, all the Blitzkater guys. I mean, I see Sass, Kieran, Drackey, and uh, on the Allied side. Uh, shoot, I've played against Heavy a couple of times. Uh, Pothead, I don't like him. Jetmo over there. So, uh, you know, over on the Allied side, the HC guys, they always take me in and let me help them out anytime I play that side. Most of you guys know I probably play both sides. I'm the dreaded team swapper guy but I always play for the team I'm playing for so uh, I've had fun I've been in and out over the years you know sometimes with uh, financial problems now I'm supporting the game as a builder right now I wish I could give more I can't wait to uh, help get into closed beta and start working on 1.36 with these guys you know doing some work there for them and overall, I just have fun. I love every single one of you. Keep playing. Please, keep playing and keep paying. Because without you guys, this game can't go anywhere. And Thank thanks, you. guys. Thank you, Tendal. Carl, you're up next. Cat5, you're on deck. Okay. Go ahead. Go ahead, Carl. You're alive. Hey, okay, sorry. Um, I'm a relatively new player. only came back a few months ago. But I can see from the community what little exposure I've had, why this has lasted 15 years, and why, if done well, will last 15 more. And that's just about it. Thank you, Carl. Welcome to the community. It's great to have an addition. I'm sure you'll be around a long time. Cat5, sir? You have the floor. Couldn't help myself. <laughs> hey, thanks. It's the people. It's the only reason I come back. I come back for the squad, I come back for the side, I come back for the Axis side. I've got friends on both sides and there's nothing compares in the world of PvP, player versus player, to this. This is the game where you can come and use your mind as well as your Twitch. My Twitch skills are not that brilliant, but I can use my head here. And like I say, I come back for the people again and again, they're always here. And this is where you go, this is where you return to. There's nothing else that competes. That's it. Good job. Carry on, Cat5. It's always a pleasure. Uh, I feel the same as you. Is there anyone else that has anything they want to say? All right, Irish, stand by. Go ahead, sir. Well, I am a new player. Uh, I just started a few months ago, really. The Lancers took me in and adopted me, and... Uh, these guys are a bunch of crazy monsters out there, and uh, I love it, going out and blowing up stuff with them. I've never played an FPS before. I don't think I'll ever play another one, but I can't get enough of this one. And I got my 13-year-old son in on it. We both have uh, premium subscriptions now, and you're going to see us around here for a lot of years. Hoorah! Welcome, Irish. Thank you very much, sir. Pothead, you are up. I just wanted to say I love you, Tando. Even though you can hate me, you know, I'll still love you. <laughs> and I really love you guys. Me and my wife, us, Sheila, have been playing this game for about 10 years now. And we had a break for a few years, but I've been back for a couple of months and really amazing battles, amazing experience. And it's not just the game. World War II Online is a lifestyle. And, yeah, I hope to keep it alive for another 45 years to come. Keep it up. My yeah, my newborn coming soon as well. She's going to be playing soon. She's been playing already, I think. <laughs> Congratulations on the newborn. Thank you. Rebel357, I believe you had something to say. Yeah, this is Reb. I just wanted to say thanks to all my victims on the Axis side and welcome back to all the old players who came back to, for this uh, event. And uh, I'm getting old and 
probably won't ever be able to be the number one fighter pilot again, so if you shoot me down again, just think you're hurting an old man's feelings. That's all. <laughs> Apparently he's saying if you kill him, you're not as good as he used to be. All right. I'm dead. You have something to say, sir. Uh, I'm pretty much the same as everybody else. It's because of the people. I uh, started in beta way back when, too far to remember, and uh, love the game. You know, but I'm glad you guys are doing some super improvement. Appreciate it. No problem. I'm Thank you very much. Old Zeke, you're up. Yeah, it's me or what's left of me. <laughs> and I'm not the oldest player in the game. Uh, yeah, it's it's been a wild ride. Fifteen years. I've got my grandson sitting here beside of me on a second account. And I started playing before he was born. I've got pictures of him sitting on my lap in diapers playing this game. And what other game can you say that about? It's 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 been a wild ride. Uh, the old team did. I'm sure they they put their heart and souls into it. This team is doing the same things are looking bright so keep it up keep playing thank you Zeke all right is there anyone else going once going twice put a tear in my eyes Zeke. Saska, let me just find you, sir. You're up, sir. Hey, guys. Uh, again, uh, CRS, fine job on the game. Uh, I've only been playing for the last five months, and I've already arisen to, uh, to high command. Met a lot of great people on this game, um, on both sides of the of the field, uh, like Pothead, East Strike, uh, all the guys in BK. Um, yeah, this is more than just a game. It is a family, and uh, it's a game that I will definitely play for many years to come. And uh, it's a real privilege to be uh, a part of all of this. Well done, everybody, and uh, uh, thanks for letting me be a part of this. You're very much welcome, Dark Mouse. You're up, sir. Hey. Just want to let you all know that um, I'm early second year the game started when I was health was in extremely bad condition and I was blessed to hook up with um, one of the greatest squads that I've ever seen, Iron Wolves. I've met, a, I've met a ton of you guys at um, at um, mini cons and everything, Wolves and others alike, and I, every single person I met was an amazing person. It's the player base here is, just makes this game so amazing, and the rats come 99% from the player base and everything. You can't do any better. Well, Dark Mouse, I do remember the Minicon, and you danced very well with my wife. Thank you for taking that uh, burden off my shoulders. <laughs> okay. Uh, is there anyone else? Final call for the alcohol. Oh, I have one there. Okay, Southwest 25. You're up. SW2591st, you're up, sir. Pass. All right, Jetmo, stand by. Go ahead, sir. How y'all doing? Uh, this is uh, Jetmo. Been in the game since June. Well, so the forums say June, so I don't know exactly when I started, but because I came in the forums a little bit later. But you know, I seen I computer gaming world right about the game. Before that, and then when it started, I just couldn't wait to get in it. Been in it since. Started with the Seahawks on the Allied side, and then uh, and then uh, they all switched over to Axis. I was kind of reluctant to go, and then when I came over here, they all switched back. So, <laughs> so I ended up staying Axis and joining the Iron Wolves, and uh, it's been fun since. Iron Wolves, you got it. It's good to have you, Jet. Thank you. All right, Puffler and Tyndall also want to uh, thank Willie T. Puffler, you're up. All right, I came 
to this game in 2004 and in 2005 my best friend died uh, it's been 11 years Jesus and then this was where I went this game to talk to the people and it was my therapy so I love this game and uh, hope to stay for many years this game means so much more than just wasting time on a computer. It is truly uh, electric pen pals and support network. We're there always for you, everyone. Good job. All right. Tandle, I'll, I'll give you grand power, sir. You there, Tandle? Yeah, I'm here. Sorry, I just wanted to say I forgot to mention all about Willie T and his comics. That's actually what brought me to this game in the first place, 2005. I was somebody, – somebody had mentioned him once upon a time, and I looked him up and watched him and died laughing. Where the hell is Willie T? Why isn't he still playing? We need to get him back. That's Definitely. all. Definitely. It made a fun part of the game. He had texted me the other day. He intends to come back, by the way. Very soon. He's on vacation in Arizona, I think. He did post a new comic in the forums a month ago, if you haven't seen it yet. All right, if everyone's prepared, this will be the last comment. Uh, Koila has a Scottish blessing. I can only wait for that one for us. Decoder ring. <laughs> Decoder ring on. Koila, you're up live. Go ahead. Hi. He of if. Ways like us. Nay at all. When the sun rise in the morning, she go down in the night. There's one for I remember. And that's them all. Remember their names. Stand true to yourself. Salute to our foreign comrades. God bless you, boys. On that very good note, thanks, Koila. Um, let's take a moment on this bridge. On this bridge is very important. First off, this bridge commemorates... Um, this is the very first city that was ever put into this game. And please hold your fire in the game for a minute. Uh, a lot of meaning has gone into this bridge, and it's very intentional. You can see this is a, a very unique bridge if you look around. Um, we have several... Uh, fallen soldiers' names who are on these plaques, and in their honor, I'd like you guys to take a minute to look at these plaques and uh, perhaps provide a salute and just review their names. So go ahead and, after that great note from Koila, let's uh, honor those who have truly fallen and who uh, were part of our community. And of course, if you did not hear, uh, we recently lost Keezy. Um, we don't know exactly what happened, but it sounds like uh, some something that, that she, she had an incident and they passed away after a couple weeks after the complications. Um, now, this is also a builder bridge. A lot of guys who invested into the game and to help us um, do a lot of good things are also on these plaques. Um, and they helped us pave the way to get to this point. So we'll spend a couple minutes just looking around, looking at these names. You may recognize some of them if you see them in game. Uh, give them a thanks. They helped us uh, do some pretty big things. We'll spend a couple minutes just doing this, and then we'll, we'll wrap up. And I'm really glad everyone's here. So let's uh, just have a little moment of silence here as we review these names and also consider the recently fallen uh, soldiers over the last year, which has uh, unfortunately been more than I've seen in previous years.
Okay. Um, thanks, everyone. I want to make a correction. I had made a statement earlier that this was uh, the bridge of some fallen. There are likely some people who have fallen here. Unfortunately, that was a mistake on my part. There are several monuments like these in game. This is the Builders Bridge, and these are the people who strictly uh, invested into our future and to help us out. Um, there may be a couple names who are no longer with us, but that's a mistake on my part. As you go through our cities in the game, so there are several terrain objects, particularly uh, statues that have, um, you know, someone holding another soldier. Those would reflect definitely those who have fallen. Uh, irregardless, it's important for us to not only know who these people are who helped pave the way, but also to give uh, that moment of silence and respect to um, our fallen comrades. Um, that being said, as a final token and appreciation for everything that we've been able to achieve as a community, let's go ahead and burn through a whole clip of whatever we got, point it out, and start blasting away, and we'll wrap it up. Ha <laughs> ha!